Hi everybody. I'm this is Rose and Rose M's Creations is my new tag name. Um I know I've done I do videos for the library, but I am going to start adding more content to my own channel. Um and what I'm practicing or what I'm not doing for the library. So I thought I'd give this a whirl this way. I am going to do, so I'm doing my initials, R and M. These are that MDF um, board. Got them at Hobby Lobby. And I'm going to do flip cups on them and then once they've dried after a couple weeks, I'm going to resin them and we'll hang them up. Um, I do like to do flip cups and uh, on wood and, and stuff. So I wanted to show you, I did this, hopefully you can see it. I did this um, birdhouse. I did a flip cup on this side and let it drip down to the edges, waited a day. Turned it over and did a more of a ribbon. I couldn't do a flip cup because of the the holes for the, the birdies. Um, and then let that dry. And then I just did a solid painting on the roof and the base. So it's all ready for the birds this spring. And I did prime these with house paint. Um, it just makes it so the, the paint's not sucked into the wood. So I'm going to start out with the R. So I've got my fun gold that I like, and I've got pearl white, and I've got a deep purple. That's going to go on bowls, but then the R is going to have some pinks and reds, and the M is going to have some blues. I have some shift color paints as well. So I'm going to do three little ones on the R and two bigger ones on the M. So, all right, so I'm gonna quick try to, I'm going to, I'll just fill the cups up here and get going. So I hope you guys are well. Sorry, I haven't put anything on my own channel, but I, it's time now. <laughs> so I like flip cups because you can get some cool results and it's very random, very unique, one of a kind. Um, so, and I'm going to put the gold towards the end, I think. All right, so this is the purple color. So, and I'm going to fill the cups up. And now I'm going to do the gold. I hope you can see this. This is a new setup. Hope my phone doesn't fall on to what I'm doing. <laughs> that would stink. And this is a pearl white. <clears throat> I did just mix these paints, so I am going to have to um, torch them. And then this is the color shift. Which could be cool. And I've got some red. Don't want the red to take over. And I think I'm going to end with what I started with, the pink. So I think I'll fi fill the M um, paint next also. So then all the paint's ready and okay. 
So this this one I'm gonna do blues. So I did some wood cutouts during the holidays. Um, and that was a lot of fun. They did um, paw prints. Some people call them brass knuckles. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> uh, they weren't supposed to be brass knuckles. So, I don't have that many followers on this channel, so I really would love my subscription subscribers to increase. So, if you're enjoying this, subscribe to the channel and doesn't cost anything and just tells me that you're showing me your support which I would appreciate. All right. Oh, almost forgot the gold. Yeah. I think I'm going to put white again because I'm going to put the gold in. So th these ones are bigger. And I guess I'll, if it's not enough paint, we'll just add more. All right. Hopefully that's enough. Okay. So here we go. Hope you can see this. Oh, look, I got some blue on there. I didn't want blue on there. If not, we'll have take two. <laughs> Okay, so I guess I'll, this is the part that makes you nervous. <laughs> I'm not nervous. I only had three of these little cups. If I had, oops, that spilled over. If I had more, I would have done one over here, which I might have to refill that. We'll see. So this one I'm going to do up here. Okay. <laughs> All right. So then I'm going to let it drain out a little bit. Um, try to think of what I'm going to do. The thing with these are uh, once you get your, your paint covered and you're happy with it and tilted and whatnot, you're going to want to scrape the bottom with a popsicle stick so it stops dripping. <clears throat> and you got to do that a couple times because I've had paintings just, I've forgotten. And I've done it and come back and half the painting has slipped out. So, all right. Hmm. I think I'll do this one first. Okay. We ready? Ready? <laughs> And I'm going to kind of flip it and go this way. Okay. Yeah. I'm just going to let that drain there. And that one. I'm going to let it drain there. There. Okay. We'll wait a minute. And I'll do this. This one's already seeming to drip a little bit, so let's get this one done. Yeah. All right. So now let's move the cups. And before I start tilting this out, I have this uh, new blow torch and um, I was having a lot of trouble with it yesterday. So, see, I don't know. I must not be coordinated with it. It's gonna stay. I, 
I don't know what it is. I can't get that one to work. Let me use this one. So there's that gold that's really cool. And I might need more paint. So who knows? That's okay. We'll do more paint. So in the future, I might not even always talk during these. I might just put some music, background music. So let's see if this is going to move. And I'm trying to make sure I don't get it on the M because I, and I know I'm not showing you how I'm tilting it. I think this one's going to need more paint. So, that one's going to need more paint. This one might too, but I'm loving the, that. So, let's. It's all right, we got the cups. It's tricky. It's tricky. It's tricky. Uh, just trying to have it go down the edges. Paint might be too thick. All right, I'm gonna put another put another cup together over here and do it here and there. So let's see. I'll do it there. Maybe you can see it. Let's get the R straightened out. It's fun to see how the paints develops to like the reactions to the other colors I think is kind of cool did I put this color in I don't even know mm. I don't think I want red hmm I know, sorry. No, no, all right, we'll just do a touch of red. Even though I just said I didn't want red, <clears throat> here I am doing a touch of red. See, this is just developed, just sitting here. I feel like I need more paint up here. So, there, and I need some more here, so. I'll do that. <clears throat> this is the, um, the Decoat 24 karat gold. That's just the coolest stuff. Hard to get your hands on. Because everybody likes it. Mm. All right, so mm, I think I don't know. How am I going to do these skinny ones? I think maybe I'll just pour. And then flip.
And then I'm gonna put the, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna see what's happening over here. Did it all come out? And try to get down here a bit. Oh, I thought I had too much paint. So I can speed this part up if I need to. Okay, so I'm just gonna kind of do the, the edge here, and I'm gonna do that there. And I'm gonna see what happens here. Okay. And we'll do this again. All right, let's see which one. I guess we'll do this one. What's tricky is you're looking at one part of the letter, but then all of a sudden you're losing focus on the other part. So that's that. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause this and then I will come back and I'll show you the finished result. Here's what I think I'm gonna do. So that I can tilt away and not feel like I'm boring you guys. Okay, so I will be back with the finished result in one second. All right, so that took much longer than I expected and more paint than I expected. But here's the R, and I've got cells and lacing. This is wet. It might develop when it's dry. And then here's the M. Got some cells. some lacing. So they are going to dry probably. They might develop some more and they're going to, I'll show you the dry, <clears throat> dry results and um, I'm going to plan to resin them in a few weeks. All right. So thanks for joining me. Subscribe. Peace. Got pain on my hands. Bye everybody. All right. Here's the Dry the results. Here's the R. Pretty much stayed the same. And the M. I'm really happy with it. There you go. See you next time.